Hello, welcome to our final lesson in the Teach Yourself Excel series from ExcelExperts.com. This is on how to create hyperlinks. Hyperlinks are a very useful way of navigating easily around your worksheet. And to show you this, I'm going to create an index page for our expense tracking system. If you want to follow along, go ExcelExperts.com, Teach Yourself Excel, Excel Lesson 27, Create Hyperlinks, download the starting sheet, and follow the step-by-step -step instructions. Let's do that now. Here's our, here's our spreadsheet. First thing we need to do is select the index worksheet. If you can't see the index worksheet, what you can do is click on these. That one will take you to the very first worksheet in the workbook, and that one will take you to the very last one and these two will enable you to navigate in between. Or you can right click and choose from there. So we've selected the index worksheet. In B2 we're going to type index. Then we select the data worksheet. We'll click on cell A1, we'll copy it, we'll go back to index, click paste, and choose as hyperlink and then we'll type data. Now this has pasted a hyperlink to the data worksheet so if I click here it takes me directly to my data that's handy. We can do the same for all of the others copy, index, there, paste as hyperlink don't like that name so I'll just change it there monthly summary and here exactly the same thing paste as hyperlink summary by expense type delete that and then the necessary expenditure index paste as hyperlink we'll add back the question mark then what we can do, click here, type Alt O C A, that formats that. Put that as a heading, and then put a little border around these. And there you have it, the finished product. Your expense tracking system is now complete, and you can navigate between all of the summaries fairly seamlessly, update the data, get the charts to update. Hope you've enjoyed the course. Welcome any feedback. Log on to excelexperts.com and tell me what you want to see next. Thanks very much.